Alright guys, welcome back to Zero Plays, Moimon Megafire Red version for 16-bit winter. Last time, uh, our, uh, our, uh, Midori is all grown up, she's become a beautiful young woman, and, uh, she's our first third stage evolution, our first Pokemon level 30 as well. So now, um, we've got to get both Makoto and Mizuki. Makoto's going to get a lot of training in the next in the rocket area, so Mizuki gets some level ups, Gitsari has some level ups, so I'm just going to probably switch these two around. Then we get Smugma some level ups, because these are the next ones in line to evolve, so that's, that's where we're going with this, so anyways. Let's continue on to Route 8 here. And, because there's still some trainers that we need to fight before we can move on to the next area. Fought that dude. My bike's acting up, man. We'll call a mechanic. Like, why are you telling me? Go Seriously, go call a mechanic. What can I do that a mechanic isn't going to be able to do? Wow, critical hit. Nice. All right, take that pirate coughing. Mizuki's now level 28. Hell yeah. And then a bit to Scyther. Ooh, I wonder what Scyther looks like. Scyther's one of my favorites, so I can't wait to see. Oh. Oh my god. Scyther's fucking awesome! I love... Uh, she's got uh, cute breasts, and the scissor pieces remind me of Kill La Kill. She's like... Oh, that's so cool! Too bad I'm probably not going to be able to get one, because if I get a Scyther, it's not going to be able to... F oh, I wish Scyther could learn Fly! Because I would totally switch out for Scyther. Scyther's one of my favorites. I love Scyther. What the fuck is Smart Strike? Is that a... Steel move? Well, it doesn't matter now because Scyther's down. I can't. Sy that's such a cool sprite. Oh man. Um. I'll just keep Smugma out. What the? F why the fuck not? To fight Grimer. Yeah. Damn it. Okay, I got ancient power. Take that, Grimer. All right. Oh man, I'm not into this. Oh. None to what, dude? What is fucking up with you? Just a weird dude. Okay, this guy. I want to fight him too. All right, so let's play a game. Would you like to play a game? Truth be told, I own. The Saw movies. Like, I bought them when a store was going out of business. Ooh, Polywag is cute with the little... Wait, have I seen Polywag before? Yeah, because I remember talking about the swimsuit and the, like, the, the school swimsuit and the goggles. Yeah, I seem to remember, recall talking about that. But, oh, it's still cute. Polywag is still adorable. She looks like she's getting ready for swimming lessons. Okay, I don't get the logic here. Use Rain Dance to power up water moves, and then use Double Slap. I guess a water move wouldn't do as much damage to Mizuki, but... Uh, Poly Toad? Really? Okay, well I'm gonna switch Pokémon and let Saria take care of this. Let's see what Poly Toad looks like. Yeah, that isn't as great as I thought it was. Whoa, is that a back shot? Oh, oh, she's, oh, she's bent down on the other way. Oh, that's kind of, kind of seductive. But I mean, it's an okay model. But like, whatever, Polytoad, whatever floats your boat, or if you be it floats your frog or whatever. See, I thought this was gonna be Polyrath. That'd be cool. I or Polyworld. I would have been cool with either one of them. I'm cool with Politoed too, because I wanted to see what it looks like, but eh, it's kind of underwhelming. It's a little thick, though. Politoed thick, like. 
go. Oh, now it's send out Poliwhirl. Alright, let's see what Poliwhirl looks like. Oh my god. Is that... Are those like white boxing gloves? That's so fucking cute. I love it. It's adorable. She's like, oh, she's ready to go. She's ready to box. Oh, man. That's... That's so... That's... That's cute. It's like a swimmer who's also a boxer. That's kind of neat. I love the design of Poliwhirl. Man, a lot of great designs this part. It's gonna be hard to pick a thumbnail. <laughs> like... It's probably gonna be Scyther, though. Let's be real. It's probably gonna be Scyther, because Scyther's <laughs> one of my favorites. Um, anyways, that takes care of that gamer guy over there. Underground path. So that leads to. So let's. Wait, this is. What? Lavender to Celadon. Okay, so you can't go this way yet, because the guys are thirsty. He's like, man, I'm thirsty. And I'm probably gonna fight this guy, too. Well, I don't have to, but I should. You look good at Pokemon, but how is your chemistry grade? Never took chemistry. Thankfully. I took physics. Because that was more appealing to me than chemistry. I guess I could probably use Water Pulse against Voltorb. It doesn't matter, but I'm just like, eh, whatever, I'll use Bite. To use Emolga. Um... Yeah, I'll change Pokemon. Sounds like something that Smugma should take care of. Oh, right, I forgot the smug fucking Emolga bitch. Fuck. Alright. At least I got burned from attacking. I'm gonna use Ancient Power, hopefully this does something. Yes! Take that, you smug bitch! Given the laugh face, like you're, like, you're just, like, you're fucking some teenage girl and a Japanese schoolgirl laughing at fucking whatever. And it's gonna use a Slugma, so I'm gonna switch back to Mizuki. Oh, bye, Furnace. All right, let's use Water Pulse. Bam! All right, back to use Magnemite. Uh, I want to switch back to Smugma, but I probably should heal Smugma up in that case. Um, yeah, I should probably heal it up. I'll keep Mizuki out. Mizuki can take a hit. If Magnemite, Magnemite even wants to use, like, a, a fucking, what's it called, a, a, uh, an electric attack, we'll see what happens. I'll use Thunder Wave. I guess that counts. Uh, speaking of paralysis, I'm also gonna heal, um, do I have Paralyze Heal? Wasn't I just saying, oh yeah, I do have Paralyze Heal. It's Awakening that I don't have a lot of. Alright, Smugma's cured a bit. Now he uses Thundershock. I mean, it probably would've killed me anyways if he used Thundershock. Oh, maybe not. Uh, maybe if I'm lucky I'll get... No, figured that much would happen. Alright, Musiki's down. So, Smugma, give it your all. You're almost at level 30 as well. Alright, so... Flame Burst! Take that. Bam. Alright. 81. Nicely done. Oh, that was a rhyme. Ow, meltdown. Alright. Alright, anyways, let's make our way to... Celadon. Alright. Alright, let's see if there's anything in here. Worth the damn. Alright, well... I heard Sleepy Pokemon appears out in Celadon City, too. Yeah. Yep, that's Sleepy Pokemon. Is there a trainer out here? No, there isn't. It's just... Oh, okay, it's a wild Pokemon. I'm thinking of second gen, there's a trainer out here. Two Odysseys, come on.
Oh, Razor Leaf hits both them, but Magical Leaf doesn't. It's Flame Burst. Oh, oh, Flame Burst hits two of them, too? Or did I just choose the wrong one? Whatever. There we go, the one that's level 19 is dead. Will this give any... Oh, no, it hit both of them. Okay. Well, that worked. I don't know if that was worth anything, but... Let's go into Celadon City. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Let's heal our Pokemon first, though. Yes. Alright, so we finally made it to Celadon, which means we'll probably have another Pokemon to evolve here in a second. Pokefood awakens sleepy Pokemon, you know that. It does with a sound that only those can hear. Okay. Now, let's see. There is a Pokemon that we can get um, right here. And, uh, this is the, uh, nothing that I don't know that I wrote in the blackboard. I know that we're a Game Boy together. Get with your friends and enjoy trading Pokemon. Alright. I obtained an Eevee. Um, I'm not gonna give a name to Eevee. So, I think I know what Eevee looks like now. Um, I'm not gonna open the Pokedex, though, because that would be a bad time. I'll take a look at Eevee later. Not that I'm probably going to train Eevee in this playthrough, but I know what the other th evolutions look like. Well, a few of them anyways. Um, anything over here? Yes, there's an item. Found Ether. Alright. Anyways, let's make our way over to... Is there something here? I feel like there's something here. No, there isn't. Okay, good. Alright, let's make our way over to get the coin case. Which you find by going into one of these areas here. I don't remember which shop it is. Is it this one? No. This is the this is the hotel. Is it this one? No. This is some dude's, some business person's thing. It's probably this one. Yes, this is it. Go ahead, laugh. I'm flat out busted. No more slots for me. I'm going straight. I'm going straight here. I won't be needing this anymore. All right, got the coin case. So now that we have the coin case, we can get access to the uh, the arcade, which will. Give us more options here. What I need to check here real quick is, I want to see what the prizes are in this one. Is it still Dratini and them, or... We'll exchange coins for a prize. Which prize do you like? Miracle Seed, Charcoal, Mystic Water, Yellow Flute. No thanks, okay. Miracle Seed might be good. Uh, Abra, Clefairy, Dratini, Oh, you can get a Scyther by giving points? I forgot about that. Ooh. Oh, it's too bad. It is too bad that, like... Ugh. It's too bad that it can't... Oh, man. I just really need a flying Pokemon. It's just too bad I can't learn. Okay, so a few TMs here. I don't know what any of these are, but... Check back another time. Anyways, let's go into Salon City and... I found 10 coins. Sweet. Is this a slot machine? Um, yes it is, okay. Yeah, I'll quit playing. I'm not gonna do the slots right now. There's this guy who's shady. I ain't talking about Slim Shady, if you know what I mean. Uh, I can't remember if this guy's Eradicate or what, but you know what? Yeah, you know what? Yeah, I'll keep uh, Music Gear in front. Regarding this poster, go away or else. Uh, how about no? Alright, Raticate? Alright. I figured it'd have a Raticate or something. Raticate's still fucking cute. Like, just weird. Of all Pokemon that ended up being adorable, Raticate being ended up one of the more adorable ones. Alright, there we go. That takes care of Raticate. 
<laughs> you could say I eradicated it. <laughs> I've made that joke before. Betty Zubat. Yeah, I'll switch Pokemon. I'll let uh, Makoto handle that one. Try it Thunderbolt on a Zubat, see how much it does. This will probably kill it one hit. Yeah, I figured as much. It's a good move. Thunderbolt's a good ass move. Even though uh, physical attack is its for is strong front, Thunderbolt's a good move. Team Rocket Hyatt might be discovered. I better tell boss. Uh, well, what could be behind this poster? Yeah, let's push the switch behind the poster. And here we are in the rocket hideout. Uh, but you know what, guys? I think we've gone far enough. So, next time on Zero Plays, Moemon, Mega Fire Red version, 416 bit winter, we will investigate the rocket hideout. See you then. Hey guys, my Discord server is finally public, so if you'd like to join, click the link in the description and make sure to read the rules.